Hello, welcome to today's video. I'm starting in Falmouth. Or oh, Penryn, as but it's class Falmouth. Where I will probably go to Penzance. And the lizard. Good day. So waiting for the U2 to Falmouth Moor. And I'll be off, so goodbye. Later. Hello. We're in Falmouth now. I'm about to get the 35A to Helston. And then from Helston, I'm gonna go to the Lizard. That's my goal. I didn't realise the Lizard, I thought the Lizard was uh, Penzance towards that way. But, nope. It's Helston. And get a bus straight from Falmouth to Helston. And then the Lizard. As long as the bus isn't late, I'll make it. But it'll be hard. So, see you later.
back. Completely forgot to film. Uh, I was just at the Lizard, the most southerly point in Britain. And I was the most southern person in Britain at a point. And I went down to the very nice beach at the bottom. It's only quaint. Very small beach. Crystal clear waters. It's beautiful. Weather's hot. Doesn't feel like I'm in the UK at all. Tell you that. Feels like I'm abroad. It's so hot here and dry. It's a good sort of heat, not the uh, typical British heat. But the sea was very nice. Cool and relaxing and perfectly clear. Walking back to the bus now. I had a two hour, uh, two hour uh, wait here for the bus. So I chilled at the lizard for a while. And now I'm going to catch the L1. Gonna think, not to Red Roof, I don't think, but to Helston. Or the military base again. Which is basically Helston still. And then from Helston, got back to Falmouth. Falmouth. Hang on. Yeah, back to Falmouth, where I will get the U1 to Truro, or I'll get the train to Truro. Depending on time, I might explore Falmouth a bit more. Turns out there's a beach there. That was a like a dark grey sand but it was covered in like pebbles it was re really picturesque but I now I need like a white sort of beach which we don't really like have but you know an orange sandy one but yeah so I'll be back in a minute, the people are so again. Walking down the farm path to Lizard Village. We're from Helston, go Falmouth and Trotter. I was thinking of going Nuki, but I think I'll, I think I'll leave Nuki now. Depending on the time I might go Nuki. Because they're very nice beaches there. I just want to chill in the sun, to be honest. And there's a lot of traffic. So one disadvantage, right? What I have to do is um, the bus I got on, I had to get like six minutes. Um, it couldn't be more than six minutes late, basically. But the road it went down was close. So I had to turn all the way back around to Falmouth, which made it about thirty minutes late. So that's why I had to get off at the military base because the L1 does meet it there. So I did that. Just walking through the village now, I that's quite close. What time is it? 35. Bus is at 14. It's a lovely walk. Highly recommend coming down to the lizard. Personally, it's way better than Land's End. Land's End's a tourist trap. This is the but yeah, this is the most southerly point in the UK and it's beautiful. So don't go to Land's End. Come here to the Lizard. You can even, you can climb a lighthouse too if you want. I did not do that but it's not my choice. Or it is my choice. I just didn't have time. About 15 minute walk though. Yeah, it's about a 15 minute walk from the Lizard Village, is where you'd be dropped off by a bus, to Lizard Point, which is the very southerly point. And it's highly recommended. If you follow me on Instagram at Jack Holden Travels. You'll see, the same name as me, uh, YouTube, you'll see some of the pictures of what the beach looks like. So drop a follow there, and yeah.
see through pictures my travels and that's been going for a lot longer so before I started the channel from Cornwall last year as well is on there so I'm gonna leave you for now and probably see you back in Falmouth
Hello, at Truro Railway Station, and I'm ending it here today because I'm going to use the bus Wi-Fi again as I did yesterday to upload the vlog and edit. Farewell. Have a good one. Just waiting for a T1 now, Tinners, which I'll do eventually at some point. Fully. It's St. Ives last year, so this year depends on. Got the Tinners, and I'm going to leave you now. So goodbye.